Okay, so my prediction for the college football playoff championship is that Michigan will win. And I'm going to make a bold statement and say that the final score will be in the neighborhood of around 24 to 13. I know for college games, they do tend to be higher scoring compared to pro games. But I feel Michigan's defense is so good that they will contain Washington's offense. Not shut it down, but contain it. Despite Washington having a Heisman finalist at quarterback and a Blitnikov finalist as one of the receivers and the other receivers in that core are NFL caliber from what I've read. I feel that Washington or Michigan's defense, based on the small sample that I've seen, they will get after Penix Jr., who even though he is a dual threat quarterback, he does have a history of knee injuries. And I didn't see a lot of design run plays. And I think he would be reluctant to take off running, especially with his draft stock so high. Um, yeah. And I feel Michigan's offense is good enough. They've got play playmakers at key positions. And I feel they'll do better than their first half against Alabama. They weren't able to capitalize on all those extra possessions from those sacks that their defense got. But I feel... Their confidence must be high, right? Able to pull things off in the clutch, like in that final drive uh, at the end of regulation to tie the game and then again to start overtime. Um, I And I felt going into that weekend that whichever team scored 21 points first was going to win the game because I felt it was just going to be low scoring. The pressure was just going to be great. Not just the defensive pressure, but just like the psychological pressure of playing in the Super Bowl. And that ended up being the case. The Broncos won 24-10. to 10. Um, All going back to the Super Bowl, the second Super Bowl between Tom Brady and the Patriots, against Eli Manning and the Giants that year the, the Patriots um, went into the Super Bowl undefeated and Tom Brady and Randy Moss set a record for regular season touchdowns but in the end they only put up 14 points and if you recall that press conference Tom Brady's reaction scoffing at, at hearing Plaxico Burris's prediction of the final score and that prediction ended up being correct it was 17-14 so just because, basically what I'm saying is just because an offense is really high-powered on offense and they've proven themselves over the course of the season and the postseason, that doesn't mean they're going to put up those same numbers in the final, right? Because that team they're going to face in the final is probably going to be really good. And they're probably going to have at least an above-average defense. Um, so again, that's my prediction. 24-13, to 13, favor Michigan. I think... It'll be kind of like Super Bowl 50. Whichever team scores 21 points first is going to win the game. It'll be pretty cagey, fairly low scoring. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Um, if it ends up being a total shootout, uh, as long as it's entertaining, that's more important. But even more important is that Michigan wins. I'm hoping that they win. Um, yeah, so we'll see if my prediction holds true. Yeah, looking forward to a good game.